Welcome back to SA Live. We are bringing you a popular holiday stew that's sure to warm you up on these cold days. Oh, yes, indeed. And helping us make this is chef and author Carino Cortez with La Familia Cortez. Yes. So good to see you. I and know. Welcome. Good stuff. I know. This feels like Christmas time. Mm -hmm. And, you know, some people need to celebrate Thanksgiving, but, you know, we can breeze by that a little bit. So we've got our bosole stew. Yum. Mm -hmm. And we've made this in a jar form. So you can actually buy these at HEB. Mm -hmm. And we've taken the work out of it for you. So all of the, I mean, when it would take oh, just yeah. hours over the stove, you've done all that. Oh, yeah. Jar. You would have to take this chili and toast it and blend it and dry it, rehydrate it, all the things, clean it before you even got to the part mm. where you added any other ingredients. That long process, Yes. Right? And so you can have this in your fingertips, in your pantry, and it's just like two steps. Damn. And put it in a big pot, heat yes. it up, and then add whatever you want. Eat it yes. like this Absolutely. right out of the jar or just What's do whatever really you like. cool about this is that you can add your protein so mm -hmm. I like pork sometimes but sometimes you know you have some leftover chicken breasts or chicken mm -hmm. thighs in the refrigerator and you can add that in there so you can go ahead and add some pork in there All right, we're gonna tag team this all right you're just gonna put that in the in the big pot yes there. Uh -huh. go, okay go for it oh, so sorry. in the jar you, you can add already. whichever protein <laughs> and yeah. I always add extra hominy some people you know like a little bit I like a lot it just makes it more I of a love stew a lot of it too. Mm -hmm. yes. Ooh, and it makes it go a little bit further and then what's also cool is that our jar, we made it vegetarian. So, you know, a lot of time during the holidays you're entertaining or you've got a family member who is a vegetarian and you don't want them to feel like an afterthought. Yes, so yes. adding some corn to this, adding some black beans, avocado, and they've got their own dish that's and just homemade. just by putting the pork in there and the hominy, look Sounds at how this amazing. has turned. Yeah, it, it has turned into just this beautiful, rich, hearty stew with um, some warm tortillas, some oh, crusty yeah. bread. Whatever oh, the case may be. The best part is the topping. So, Jen, okay, look at that. Lovely. Pick out what you like. Yes. Cabbage is very uh, common. It's one of the typical garnishes. Radishes, mm -hmm. a little bit of onions, avocado. Mm -hmm. And I love these tostadas with it. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. I'm hungry Sounds for this. Sounds amazing. This is your favorite, by the way, this right? This is my favorite. And honestly, when we developed these soups, I was thinking of my favorites. <laughs> <laughs> and what could make my life a little bit easier? So, were this you is, the official taster? <laughs> I was the official taster, and I am like the official preacher on the soup, so I tell everybody about it. Okay, and you've got others uh, in the jar too, right? Yes, so we've got our tomatillo sauce, which if you prefer uh, a pozole verde, a green pozole, mm -hmm. use our tomatillo sauce instead. And so tomatillo sauce, chicken broth, and either pork or chicken, um, same toppings, and you've got that versatility also. That's so that. nice because especially as everybody, you know, making the big Thanksgiving dinner right now yes. or having everybody over and being mm -hmm. able to pull out a jar and it is every bit as oh, good yeah. as what, what Grammy used to make, right? Absolutely. Oh, it's so good. Mm -hmm. Now you said your son loves this too, right? My <laughs> three-year-old son loves savory things okay. and he will top it with yes. the avocado, mm -hmm. with the cabbage, with the cilantro, mm -hmm. and he needs a squeeze of lime. <laughs> That's got, yeah, you can taste all the, the rich flavors in oh, there. Oh, yeah. the wine too. adds to it too. Yes, I yes. put a nice squeeze in there. Okay, I'm happy. And <laughs> I know. if you're looking for something because the weather is just going to be raw yeah, this tomorrow, is especially, mm -hmm. this mm -hmm. is going to be the perfect soup in the afternoon mm -hmm. and or for breakfast. And speaking of good food for Thanksgiving over at Mithera, people can. Oh, can yeah. Do that, right? If you don't mm -hmm. feel like cooking, we've got the full Thanksgiving menu. So we've mm -hmm. got it two versions. So if you want traditional, regular oven baked turkey stuffing, mm -hmm. all the things, We've got that menu, or you can order it Mexican style, turkey and mole. Oh, well. Really? Yeah. Ooh, Jalapeno yes. cornbread stuffing. And so, once again, of course, if folks mm -hmm. don't already know this, you're open seven days a week, 365, so even yes. Christmas dinner, too. Christmas dinner. We've got people make it a tradition to come Christmas yes. Eve, Christmas Day. It's a lot of fun. Which is so nice if you need a place to go and you don't feel like cooking. Oh, yeah. Things You've are got the, we got the lights covered. We've got the yes. music. I we've got it. dessert. Yes. Thank okay. you so much. And you're just going to be happy eating this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Any other big um, announcements or events coming oh, up? Oh, gosh. We've got La Gran Tamalada coming up in December. Mm -hmm. December. Mm -hmm. So you're going to get your tamal fix December 10th and 11th. We're going to have a dozen different tamal vendors, holiday market, poncho claws, music, all the things. I know. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you so much. I think Mike's loving this, right? I'm, I'm I know. This is right right honestly <laughs> one of the best stews. <laughs> this and is. This the is pork delicious. is amazing in here. Yes. If you'd like more information, pardon me for talking about mouthful. Mm -hmm. On La Familia Cortez and all of these great recipes, just head over to LaFamiliaCortez.com. Thank you so much. Happy Thank Thanksgiving. You. Happy Thanksgiving. Thank you, <laughs>